The Saints spent all summer installing a new system under first-year offensive coordinator Clint Kubiak. We'll just see how effective that offense is in Sunday's season opener against the Panthers. Now, New Orleans is facing a Carolina team that revamped its defense in the offseason. It was a unit that finished in the top five in total defense, near the bottom of the league in points scored in 2023. Essentially, new faces, same scheme for the Panthers. That's the opposite of what the Saints did on offense. And they want all that hard work to pay off on Sunday. I liken it to, you know, we're sitting here on Christmas Eve and, and we're waiting to see what kind of presents we got under the tree. And um, we'll find out on Sunday. I think our offensive staff have, has worked extremely hard. I think they've been very demanding, very detail-oriented in what they've, what they've been uh, asking our guys to execute. I think our guys have bought into that. Um, I think our guys have had some really good practices, and in particular over the course of the last three or four weeks. Um, and so I think we're all excited to, you know, see what kind of presents are under the tree. There's been a lot of work to, that went in to make sure that, you know, hopefully we start fast. Uh, you know, that's a that's key to us, trying to keep the same mindset we had towards the end of the year last year, um, treating all these games like do or die, you know, from the jump, um, and not waiting for a for a back against the wall type moment um, to have to do that. So. That's the mindset, you know, we're excited, um, but again, we gotta go do it, you know, but we get to put the ball down on Sunday and finally get to play, so it'll be good. Now the Saints come into Sunday healthy on offense. New Orleans is currently a four point favorite over the Panthers. Reporting at the Saints practice facility in Metairie, Ricardo LeCompte, WWL, Louisiana.